Good morning, everybody. Eugene Bear here on YouTube. R U period Eugene Bear, one word. Got my hot cup of coffee. It's so hot, can't put my right hand on it. Mmm. Got my gray shirt on. If you were in the Navy or in the military, most of the time, uh, if it didn't move, you painted it gray or green or tan. You know, uh, tan's a modern color, tan and brown. Used to be all gray and green. 1962, the Cuban crisis. I joined the Air Force. And I gave <clears throat> four years to the government as a young man. Today's teaching is about a soldier, a good soldier. A soldier that fought the good spiritual fight of faith in. Faith in what? Faith in Christ anointing. A good soldier. In fact, the good soldier Paul admonished Timothy to be a good soldier and fight the good fight of faith in Christ anointing, the Lord Jesus. The anointed one, the sent one, the Son of God. And the second half of salvation, we have faith in God that he raised his son from the dead. His son is ascended and seated, mediator of the one God. That's what scripture says. <laughs> I'm going to read to you the last blue window of Second Timothy. The last letter written by the Apostle Paul. A lot met in Paul. Judaism, Romanism, Gentilism, a lot of isms met in Paul. Second Timothy, fourth chapter, first verse. I charge you, Timothy, in the presence of God and of Christ Jesus, who is to judge the living and the living dead ones. Remember, I spoke about that in some past teachings. And by his appearing and his kingdom, preach the word, Timothy. Teach the word, preach the word. My three questions, can you repeat them on your own? Have you learned Christ? Can you teach Christ? Have you learned all the mysteries of the New Testament? Can you teach them? And what is your hope? What letter, chapter, and verse would you give if you had to tell someone what your hope was? Colossians 127. Christ in me, the hope of glory, immortality and eternal life, dwelling in the light, the glory light. We jump down to verse 5 where the blue window begins. See, see my blue window? See the blue right there? Blue door or window. As for you, Timothy, always be steady. I'm reading from a 1952 Revised Standard. Endure suffering. Do the work of an evangelist. Fulfill your ministry. That's what I'm doing. I'm heading in a new direction, a spiritual direction, a stronger spiritual direction. Uh, that's all I'll say about that for the moment. Verse 6, for I am ready, Paul, the I, Paul is speaking here, Saul of Tarsus, Paul, the Apostle Paul, Apostle, sent one, that's what Apostle means. Don't put it on a high pedestal. Actually, the highest thing you can attain to is be called a servant of the Lord Jesus Christ. Servant is higher than apostle, evangelist, prophet, pastor, and they're all teachers. It's not a five-fold ministry. It's a four. Four letters in the sacred name of God. Four is a very important spiritual number. And it's four, and every one of those are teachers. Apostles, prophets, 
evangelist, shepherds, leader, feeder, shepherd, leader, feeder, more than preacher, a proclaimer of the gospel, and those four are all teachers of truth. Okay. Um, for I am ready on the point of being sacrificed. Paul is speaking of his death here. That's why it's his last letter, 2 Timothy. I have fought the good fight. And over in 2 Timothy 2, 3, the good soldier. We read in chapter 2, third verse, share in the sufferings as a good soldier of Christ Jesus and I added Lord. And you can read about the good soldier who fought the good fight, the athlete who ran according to the rules, and the hardworking farmer would be the first one to share in the crop when it came in. Uh, and you can read that on your own over in chapter 2 of Second Timothy. So we've got, I fought a good fight. Paul is a good soldier, and he's telling Timothy to be a good soldier. Spirit soldier. I have fought a good fight. I have finished the race, or my race. Each of us have a race, the race of life. And make it to the finish line and cross in your faith. I don't care if you're on crutches, in a wheelchair, crawling, walking, running. Make it to the finish line, even if you're the last one across, because we all get the same award. <laughs> eternal life, immortality. So it matters not whether you finish first or last, just so you finish. Hallelujah. Okay. Finish your race. Stay faithful to your last breath. Was it Stephen that said he looked, he looked into heaven and saw the Lord standing, the right hand of the glory of the majesty of God, and said, forgive them, Lord, and receive my spirit. Okay, I believe that was Stephen. Stephen, when he was stoned, while being stoned. Okay, I have finished my race, or the race, Paul said. Now, Timothy, it's your turn. You're a continuator. Ever hear that word? We're all continuators. And there's 26 anointed continuators living right now on earth. Okay, I have kept the faith, and remember I add the word in. It's no longer faith alone, invisible faith, an inv invisible bucket of faith. It's faith in Christ anointing, Lord Jesus, King of kings, ascended and seated, great high priest forever. I said a lot right there. So, I have kept the faith in. It's always faith in. Just like Savior, salvation, Shua. That's why you really need to learn the five titles, how to write the name of God El Father in Hebrew, and how to write the name of the Son, Yahshua or Yahoshua. Because the Shua goes with salvation. The four things that describe salvation or Shua is Savior, Redeemer, Deliverer and Reconciler. 8.50 here. I have to finish. Henceforth there is laid up for me a crown of righteousness, which the Lord, the righteous judge, remember I read up here in 4.1, Christ Jesus, who is to judge the living and the living dead ones. Those are unsaved people walking on the earth, breathing air. They're living dead ones. Have no hope of immortality or eternal life. You must be born of the Spirit, Nicodemus, to see or to enter the heavenly kingdom of God, eternal life. And be a light being that can walk into the unapproachable light that humans cannot walk into because they would disintegrate. Flesh and blood cannot inherit the kingdom of God and walk into the light. But a light being can, similar to an angel. Okay, chase that rabbit which the Lord, the righteous judge, will award me on that day, and not only to me, but to all saint sons, all believers, beloved saint sons. 
all who have loved his appearing or appearings, plural. Do your best to come to me soon, Timothy. Because Paul was a Roman citizen, he got the quick death. He was beheaded with the sword. I love you. I'm a spirit teacher. It is so hard to teach less than 10 minutes. Just, I'm trying, but I ain't getting there yet. I'll tighten them up. I'll get them down to eight minutes. You watch. Truth teacher, spirit teacher, Eugene Bear on YouTube, tell your friends. If you hear the Holy Spirit, hear, O Israel, hear saints of God. And if you hear the Spirit in thought, in your heart, mind, your spirit, soul, and believe that Jesus is Lord and is the Father raised him from the dead, you're saved. Hallelujah. Bye.